want to know the best part about this day? What? You. I'm glad to have you back. Oh, I guess what guys, I watched all of the Bandit videos and I was shocked at what I had done and how crazy I was acting. You were being absolutely crazy. And look, nothing, there's nothing. It's all gone, there's nothing Is that a on scar on your neck? It's a mole. <laughs> That's interesting. Was that mole there before? I don't know. I wonder Weird. if maybe that was there after. It might be like a residual scar left from from turning into a bandit. That's interesting. Crazy. So anyways, Glad I you back. I know, I watched the bandit videos and I was just in shock at what, but at what I had done. you really good now. Ever since you've been healed, Oh yeah, I'm, I'm 100%. There's no bandit left no in pain me in your at, neck all. at all. No pain, good. no crazy feelings, or I'm not being crazy anymore. It's just normal life for me. Cool, I think we should have a good day today. Wait you guys, we have to open this box from Mr. E. Oh, oh yeah. yeah! Oh my gosh! I totally forgot it's about that! all of the craziness that had to do with me turning into a bandit and everything, we completely forgot to open oh, up my the goodness. treasure we need to from do Mr. That. E. And look, you can see, this is what looks like on the inside of there's it. A there's a treasure box in there. A treasure box in there in this waterproof case. Let's open it! Okay, let's yeah. do yeah. it! Let's, let's go open it inside the house. Okay. Okay, come on guys, let's go! All the kids! Everybody! We're gonna open Mr. E's clue! It's right here, it's right here! Okay, thank you, Charlie. Good <laughs> job, big boy. All right, let's go open it up, you guys. Let's see if Charlie can open this thing. <gasps> Good job! <gasps> oh! Wow! <laughs> <I> did it! <laughs> cool! <laughs> it's crazy hair. Let's <laughs> open it. Okay, now let's open it up. Let's That's take a look weird. here. It's not opening. It's not <gasps> opening. It's a trick lock. Do we have a mysterious Mr. Okay. E trick box on our hands here? Okay, so. let's see if Charlie can open it. Do you remember on our first treasure hunt that trick box that you, was a puzzle to open? Yeah. Yeah. Maybe that's what. You need some help, Charlie? Can I try? Okay, let's have Ellie give it a try. Okay, Ellie. Do you think you can find a way into this box? I think you can. These puzzle boxes. There's are no cracks so right fun. here. <gasps> so maybe all of these are just to distract us. And yeah. also look, there's some stuff right there. All right, Corbin, what do you think, buddy? Think you can open this thing up? What if you get that thing like this, so it can come out? Oh, she's saying to bang it on the ground, maybe. Uh -huh. After James, it's mom's, and then dad. Then I'll try it if you guys can't figure it out. That top piece seems to move, doesn't it? Yeah. yeah but right. not in the place you would think. Oh, I'm so excited to see where Mystery's gonna send us. <laughs> I think it's Mom's turn to try. Let's give Mommy a chance. Yeah. What about this? Ooh. <gasps> Look at that. Watch this. Look underneath. I'm gonna slide this over and look what happens. Oh! 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 <laughs> so look, if you move the bottom of the box, it unlocks it. Oh, look at that, that's cool. So look, there's some magnets on the bottom of the lid, and when you put it on here, the magnets hold it in place. If they're but, in the right place. But down when you here. push this down, then the, it actually puts different magnets that repel it and cause it to pop, and pop open. open. This is when it's shut and it's not open, and you push it over. And it, pops and it pops open. open. That's so because cool. Mr. E. <gasps> All right, we got another Let memory card. Let's go put it in the computer and see what it says. Okay. I got it on my hand. All right, and I got my computer ready to go. Tiny, tiny piece of tape. We've got a bunch of memory cards now for Mr. E. This is great. Yeah, yeah we can use that for filming. <laughs> see what Mr. E has to say today. What? This is Diamond Mission Details. Diamond Mission? What? <gasps> okay, everybody listen up. Greetings. There are many things I need to tell you. I never meant for you to be in harm's way with the bandit's treasure. I never meant for you to be in harm's way with the bandit's treasure? That's what he said, yeah. Whoa. The danger the to your family was not meant to happen. The danger to your family was not meant to happen. Whoa. I'm amazed at how you were able to pull through. 
You have proven yourself time and time again. Look up for your family is stronger than all the power of evil. The love for your family is stronger than all the power of evil, he said. For this reason, I am ready to send you on an even greater quest. For this reason, I am ready to send you on an even greater quest. Greater? How could it be greater? We just went on a two month long trip because of him. Yeah, let's see what he says. Whoa. This is the true reason for your test and training. I had to be sure you were qualified and purified. The only way to guarantee your safety on this mission is to follow my instructions with exactness. The only way to guarantee your safety on this mission is to follow my instructions with exactness. So it sounds a little bit dangerous. So it's going to be super important that you guys pay attention and follow instructions perfectly if we want to be safe. <laughs> <laughs> I think you've seen Ryan do that before. Okay. So Alright, let's see what he says here. Ready? We see the enclosure letter if you choose to accept. Good luck and stay true. Good luck and stay true. What's this? Uh, what? what is that? Is that a map? It's a map. In it's the same. It's the same. This is where we're going. I just need awesome. to get it on my phone. And then Let's we get can it go. on our phone. Okay. Cool. That's awesome. awesome. Let's go see what it is. I'm going to start packing some sack lunches so that we can ha be prepared for anything today. They're pretty full. I'm very excited to show you what's inside. I've got a ton of lunches packed and this is what we're gonna be eating for lunch. We got two peanut butter and jelly sandwiches, one of these cups of mandarin oranges, got some chocolate cookies that are animal crackers, a cheese stick, and a couple little treats. is packed and we're gonna get in pile into the van and see where this takes us. I'm so excited! And I'm so excited! Charlie, good. you get to stay with grandma today. We love you. It's nap time for our Charlie so he gets to stay home. But we don't want you in any danger. That's right. We gotta protect all you guys. Oh, that's my cute one. Uh, well, I'm <laughs> so you're gonna stay here with grandma, okay? I'm gonna bring this just in case. Okay, awesome. Let's do it. We borrowed my mom and dad's truck because we didn't know exactly how hard it would be to get to the cave, but we were just following the map and looking and we found it. Look at this. You, you can, can see, see it. it all the way from the road. It's all the way up there on the mountainside. That giant hole, that is grandpa's cave. And that's exactly where the coordinates are taking us. I think I just saw that. <gasps> yeah, that's what I thought I saw. So here's the map. So we gotta come around the corner here and then we've got a little dirt road that looks like it'll take us straight to it. Oh, that was so cool. Perfect. I'm glad we didn't try to go around the other side of the mountain. I think this is the easier way for sure. So, looks like the roadway's blocked off. So mom is here at this house. We're gonna ask them if they know how to get up to the cave. Someone it looks like someone's home, so I think we'll be okay. What's up? Okay, I had to ask a local. <laughs> What'd you find out? We need to turn around and go back out onto that main road and look for a road that turns towards that cave. I think I know exactly what road that is. Okay, let's go. There's a sheer cliff on the right side of the car. Yep. So. Look at that. We're driving on a cliff. This road almost looks like it was newly made, but grown over. This road that we're on right now isn't even on Google Maps. This around. is looking like it's going straight where we need it to go. I'm so excited. Me too. I was starting to get worried that we were not going to be able to even get to it. Yes, Mr. Yeah. E must really want us to find something important to have us go all the way out here. I wonder why he would put something all the way out here in the middle of nowhere when up to this point everywhere he's taken us has been somewhere like in a popular like place. Yeah. Uh, like a park or a theme park or a playground or like this is literally in the middle of nowhere. Yeah. Oh there yeah. it is. I can see it up there. Oh yeah I can see it too. Okay. Now we just need to figure out a Oh wait, is this a road leading up to it? Right over there? I think it is. Good man, this is not well traveled, that's for sure. We're gonna drive into boonies. There's a little canal actually. 
We're driving over it? Yeah, we just drove over a canal. Woo, put it back up. I think we could probably park the truck right here. And hike the rest of the way. And hike the rest of the way, because I don't expect there's going to be a lot of traffic, are we? <laughs> That's true. So James has got all of our lunches. Yeah, she's coming. I think she's just grabbing her phone. Be careful for snakes or things around here, guys. Scorpions or snakes. So be careful. Oh, we found it! Cool. Don't go running in there. This could be dangerous, you guys. We don't know. This is different. For some reason, Mr. E sent us a location that's far off the beaten path. That's not a place that a lot of people have gone to before, it looks like. Right. And it could be dangerous. So what yeah, we're gonna do... Like yeah, it does look like the rocks could cave in. It's a little bit. So what yeah. we're gonna do... First of all, no yelling in the cave because that could make a cave in. We're gonna go in and we're gonna see what we can find, make sure everything's safe and there's nothing dangerous in there, and then we'll call for you to come in, all right? Okay, so you guys stay out here. Should have brought my hiking boots, not my sandals. Oh, I was not prepared. I was thinking, what if there's like a bear living in here or something? There's a bird. That was scary. That was so scary. Look, there's a bird right there. Huh, this is its home. Let's all stay together. Yeah. Okay, stay together. Don't get lost. Let's go see what we can find. We got a big cave here. It's really, it's really, really, really deep. So stay together, stay close, and follow instructions and you'll be okay, all right? You ready? Okay. I think I know why this cave is called Grandpa's Cave. Because it's so old. Oh, grandpas are old, I guess. This looks pretty old. We have no idea how deep this cave is or like how big it is or anything, so I feel like we've got to be prepared. So we have our flashlights on our phones and we've got food and Corbin's got water and we're gonna be, I, I just want to make sure that we're prepared when we go in there, you know? Okay, let's go exploring. This could be really, really deep. Guys, we have to stick together. We cannot split up. I don't want to lose you guys in this giant cave. Don't get too close or you'll make it upset. It looks like it's sitting on some eggs and you don't want to get close to a mama bird because they could attack you, even if they're just a little bird. They're pr wanting to protect their baby. I don't know where the food is. I don't either. We need to try to see if we can find something from mystery, but be very careful. I think I see an animal. It looks like two glowing eyes of like a cat or something. I feel like we need a flashlight in here. It's right in that dark. It looks like eyes. Do you see that? Yes. Yeah, I can see it on camera too. Can you see it better on camera? Yeah. Doesn't it look like a shadow with eyes? The clue for mystery said this diamond. This is the exact location. It looks like there's glowing eyes in the shadow. Do you see it right there? Yeah. Wait, it's gone. I don't see it anymore. The eyes left. <gasps> it's gone. Whoa. Oh. Let me get out my flashlight. This is getting a little bit too dark. Okay, so we've been hiking in here for a while now. It's pretty deep, pretty big cave. A lot of stuff around here. Guys, stay close just keeps going and going. I'm glad I've got a really good camera so it can keep it bright even when it's dark in here. Like it looks super bright in here. It's actually really dark. Wow. It just goes up and up and up. Wow. Look at that giant spider right there. I don't see any spider. Right in, right there. Yep. Oh, oh, I see it now. Oh, that's creepy. So we gotta be looking for something. There's gotta be something in here specifically that Mr. E wants us to find. I don't know what it is. He never gave us any like instructions on what we're looking for. And right now all I'm seeing is just dirt and rocks. Do we still have that box with us to look at that note? Oh, there, there's like something purple glowy. Where? What? Over there. there. Let's go check it out. Yeah. I see it. There's something glowing. <gasps> Is it warm? It feels warm. <gasps> it does feel warm. Oh awesome. my goodness. Wow. That's cool. There. It's a gem. Becca, are you going to take it? Do you think this is what Mr. E wanted us to find? Oh, I got it. <gasps> Where's your flashlight? What happened to the light? I don't know. That's really weird. Let me turn on 
Here's the flashlight. I've got it. Whoa. Wow. Oh my goodness. I have goodness. a feeling like we need to get out of here right now. Really? Yeah. I Why? I heard someone because. who said not to take the diamond. Don't take the diamond. <gasps> Did you hear that? Oh. Wait, watch wait. Watch out, watch out, don't run. There was another clue from Mr. E. I think there was another note. What if it said Okay, not you know what? It. I'm gonna put it back right now. I feel like you're right. Here's that the note. Is really creepy. Okay, well let me put this back first. I think maybe we should have read this note first. Wait. The light's out. There's it didn't no... turn back on. Here. Okay. Read Wait. this note. What's that sound? Did you guys hear that? <gasps> oh, that's so creepy. The memory card was taped to this note. Let's look at what it says. I didn't even realize it was a note. Do not touch the diamond. Uh, oh. It says your challenge is to remove the diamond from the cave without touching it with your hands. Very important. We've touched it. Oh. Did everybody touch it? Who touched the diamond? Touched Not it. me. Well, we I heard that voice. This, and I keep hearing things. We heard a voice that said, don't touch the diamond. Do you remember that? What if there's a ghost in here? I did see what looked like eyes and they disappeared. That's right. Maybe we need to get out of here quick. Guys, I heard something. Whoa! 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 What was that? It might have been an earthquake. We need to get out of here quick. Did you hear that? Shh. Let's get out of here. I think I see smoke. Oh no! I think the caves. It caved in. I think the cave collapsed. We gotta get it out of here. What are we gonna do? I think the diamond is cursed. I've the been, light turned off when we touched it. And we've been hearing all sorts of weird sounds and seeing shadows yeah. move. And this cave is too big to- What was that? Ah! Grab the diamond and okay. let's get out of here okay, quick. let's go. Oh no, the entrance caved in and there's a gate now. We won't be able to escape. Ah, there's even a lock. How are we gonna get out of here? The whole entrance is covered by this gate now. It looks like rocks fell in and a, and a gate fell down with a chain on it so we can't even get out. How are we gonna get out of here? <gasps> what do we do? We, if we've been, there's we, only one spot we haven't explored all the way yet and that's over where the bird's nest is at. Well, why would we explore that? We need to get out of here. We need, yeah. to, we need to find the key to unlock the gate. Yeah, you we hold need this? to find the key. And we need to explore everywhere. Well, let's look at this right here. Yeah, there's a lock. It looks like the lock is the on the inside, which is really weird because why do you typically you don't have a lock on the inside? Usually it's on the outside. You guys, did you guys make any progress on that lock? No, there's not. I mean, we obviously need a key, but I don't know where a key would be. I keep hearing all sorts of weird sounds in the back of this cave. Really? And I'm pretty sure. Some shadows are moving, mm. and I have no idea why, but it's freaking me out. So, okay. look for a key. There's got to be You're a key right. in here somewhere. We've got to find a key, and then we'll be able to get out of here with the diamond. That's a big lock. It looks like it's bolted into the ground, into the rocks over here. Oh. So we need to find a so key. So even to this. if we could, oh, it's so heavy. Even if we could get it up. Yeah. Oh It's not my going goodness. anywhere. That is so heavy. There's no way. All of, this, all of this happened in a really strange way, almost like it was magical. So if we can find a key, even though this gate is so heavy, I bet it will open. We're stuck in this cave now. I think we should start by looking at the same place that we found the diamond. Because okay. right now, other than the diamond place, everything is literally just rocks. So let's go look there first. Okay. Have you still got your flashlight? Yeah. Okay. Watch for that cliff there. Stay close, Ellie. Where would you hide a key in a cavern like this? I feel like, I feel like not only would it be near maybe where we found this, but maybe it would also be up high. Like not where somebody would step on it, you know? Okay. Look in there, like there's places that things could be hidden. True. But there there's, there's virtually thousands of cracks and crevices in here. There's no way that we could search every single one of them. Did you hear that sound? This is, that's what I'm talking about. I keep hearing sounds in here. I keep hearing weird sounds. I don't know what they are. You know what? I don't know. Maybe it's time to like stop and have some lunch. We've been in here for a long time. We have been in here for a while. 
And you know what? It's a good thing I brought all of that food and water. Oh yeah. Because we're not stuck like without... Do we want to go all the way back to where the diamond was and then eat? Or do we want to just stop and eat now? Well, let's, let's go back to the front of the cave so that it, we can have light. Or at least sit underneath the... Well, we're almost to where the diamond was. You don't want to look at the diamond spot first? Yeah, let's go to the diamond spot first then. Okay. I just feel like we're already so close. We ought to at least check it out. I feel like we need to check over by this light area because we haven't explored anywhere up there. It might be tucked up a little high. Maybe it's tucked up a little low. Maybe it's tucked up a little All right, back to where we found the diamond. I think this is Where's the place. Where's that pedestal? You gotta put that back. Where was the diamond at? Uh, I know it was somewhere it's... along this rock this wall. This is where it was. Oh yeah. It even has the glass There's like pedestal. charcoal. Look, see how it's dark on this wall? Yeah. Right above where the diamond was? It's Whoa. Kind of, it's kind of interesting. Maybe, like maybe something burned? It almost yeah, looks burned, I, yeah. I, I smelt smoke, maybe it, it started steaming and getting really hot when we weren't touching it. Oh. And it started to make the wall black. That's interesting. That's really interesting. Well, let's look around here for key. <gasps> Careful. Why don't we grab that so it doesn't get knocked off? Okay. Do you see anything in there? Mm -hmm. Do you see anything, Corbin? Everybody be super mm -hmm. quiet. <gasps> Did you hear that? What was that? Guys, let's go to the front of the cave where there's a little bit more light and let's eat lunch there because I feel like this is way too dark and creepy. I'm starving too. Okay, let's go get some food. Okay. Also Come on, Ellie, let's go. It is so dark in here. I'm so glad you have that flashlight. I know, right? It's like pitch black in here. You know what? We actually do have a time limit for getting out of here. Think about it. We are gonna run out of battery on our camera and on our phones for light if we don't That's get right. out of here. My phone battery is getting pretty low because we've and, been using the flashlight so much. And there's no reception in here, by the way. In this cave, there's no reception on our phones at all. So there's no way we can call for help. We've got to figure out how to get out of here. We've got to find a clue to That's... where the key might be. Okay. Okay, we can. It's starting to get dark. We have got to get out of here. Yep. I've just cleaned up all the mess from lunch. And... You say oh, lunch, but really it was it dinner. Because we started this adventure oh, later. On the ground. We've got to take better care of this, you guys. This has got to be worth a lot of money. Someone needs to be specifically in charge of caring Please. for the diamond. I need to put you in charge of the diamond. Excuse just me. hold it in this hand like that. Be very, Be very careful, careful with it. Alright guys, it's time to get serious. We have got to get out of this cave. I needed a lunch break because I was getting hangry. But now that we're done eating, we need to get out before we're stuck here all night long. Hangry means hungry and angry. That's right. <laughs> so down here we haven't explored as much. So we've got to go down here and see what we can find. Look for anything out of the ordinary. I think that's something that we can that maybe can help us. Okay, be very careful. Okay, so we're looking for a key. We're looking in each of these crevices. Be careful of spiders. Let's use our flashlights to make sure that there's nothing in the way. I'm so glad Charlie didn't come with us, by the way. Oh my god. He goodness. would be tripping and he would be almost, he would probably be falling down this. Yeah, I'm glad he didn't come too. This is definitely not for little babies. Okay, so I'm not seeing anything in these crevices and the camera battery is almost dead. Okay, so we've looked in every single nook and cranny of this entire rock wall and we haven't found anything yet. We're still trying to look for this key. Did you guys see that? Um, I think, I think so. so. Ugh, I, I, I got like a really creepy, weird feeling come over my whole body just now. Me too. We need to get out of here and we still hey, don't know where this key is. let's go this wall over here somewhere. I think we're done looking at this rock wall. I feel yeah. like I need to get out of here. Guys, it's night. Oh. Okay. Did you hear that? It's bedtime. I don't know what else to do. I think we're just gonna have to sleep here for the night, guys. We've been here 
all day practically at this point and we still haven't found it's so dusty we still haven't found the key yet to get out yeah and i don't know what else to do but it's nighttime it's dark yeah we're all kind of creeped out but mostly we're exhausted yeah from searching and i don't know what else to do but wrap up and cuddle up and try to get comfy on these rocks yeah seriously maybe we can use some of the garbage that we had from lunch as like pillows or something <laughs> i mean to make it more comfortable oh you know oh my gosh i'm okay. using garbage as a pillow for the bedtime tonight oh, i feel like stuff's crawling on me all right guys let's go to bed everybody lay down yeah, everybody lay let's down. just cuddle up if you, can, if you want to i'll sit up and you can lay on my lap that would maybe be good. We, good i've got a great idea what? I think that we need to take turns standing watch. Okay. In case we see more of whatever it is we've been hearing and seeing in this cave. Do you understand? <gasps> Guys, shh. Okay, guys. I'm gonna I'm gonna do the first watch. You guys can lay down on my lap. Okay. I'll be your Please pillow. You can go to sleep. It'll be fine. That was so scary. Yeah, it was. Okay, I don't know if I'm gonna, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get any sleep tonight. Yeah. I'm gonna stay awake. If you wanna try to fall asleep, I'll, okay. I'll stay awake. I can. Okay. All right. Good night. Good night. Okay. It's three o'clock in the morning. I haven't been able to get any sleep, but I'm really tired. Rebecca and the kids have all fallen asleep and I keep hearing weird sounds and I don't know what it is. So far, no one has actually like, no one's actually seen anything concrete, but we just keep hearing weird sounds and it looks like shadows moving that shouldn't be moving. So I'm just a little bit freaked out right now and I wanted somebody to talk to because I don't want to wake up Rebecca and the kids. All right, I think I'm going to bed. I think I'm gonna go try to lay down for a little while. I'm so tired. So guys, so I've been like, it's been hard for me to fall asleep and I've been hearing lots of weird noises and everyone is asleep. I saw a glowing light. I wanna go check it out. Oh, I think I just heard a bat. the glowing thing. It looks purple. I see light. Whoa, it's glowing brighter. I have to go check it out. Oh. I seriously thought I heard something like move over there. Oh, this might be it. Oh, it's glowing purple. Here it is. Oh. Mom, Dad, wake up. Please come over here. I think I found something. I woke up in the night and because I heard some noises and it was really creepy, so I decided I would go check it get out and I found something glowing purple. Really? Yeah, it's right here. I bet it's the key. It might be. No way. Whoa, we couldn't see this earlier because it was too bright in the cave. But now because it's the middle of the night, we can see it. Yeah. Wow. Look up because I heard weird noises everywhere. That's got to be it. There's nothing else that would make that. Here. What if it's bad? Wait, I don't know if I want you to put your hand in there. Whoa. <gasps> the key! We found the key! <laughs> we can get out of here! 
You know what? Look out there. It's almost morning. Guys, it's almost morning. I think the sun is actually starting to come up a little bit. Okay, let's go. I can't believe we stayed an entire night in a cave. <laughs> it was so uncomfortable and I'm so dusty and dirty. Let's get out of here. Okay. I don't want to be in here a second longer. This place is so creepy. Okay. I have we're the back, key. We're back to the entrance. Yeah, it's getting bright outside. Can you unlock it? Can you see? It's still pretty dark out. Oh, I hope this works. Oh, we need to get out of here. James, I'm so glad you found this. Yeah. But you probably shouldn't be wandering around at night in a scary cave. Next time. Do you need some help? Yeah. Okay. I probably need some light or something. Okay, let's let mom give it a shot. Starting to get light outside, but we have got to get out of here as soon as we can. I, this place is too creepy. Does it fit? Oh, I got it. Is it the right kind of? Is there the right key? Or do you think it's the wrong? <gasps> it went in. It went in. <gasps> we got Yay! it. We're out. We're free. Ready? Okay. It's open. We're free, guys. Let's go. Oh, I'm so happy. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy to be getting out of this creepy, creepy cave. Let's go. We you got the diamond? the diamond? Okay, let's go. Oh, I'm so happy. Go follow James, Ellie. Follow James. The sun is just starting to come up early, early, early. I think it's like 5 a.m. or something right now. I'm so glad we are out of that cave. That was terrifying. This. I can't even believe it. This used to be the entrance to that cave. And it's all caved in. There's just a little hole behind that rock, which is where we came out. Oh my goodness. Okay, this is the road. Let's get out of here. It's early. We have everything that we brought to the cave. We don't want to make it dirty. Come on, we gotta get out of here, guys. Get in, get in. We gotta get away from this mountain. The sun is still just coming up. Get in, get in. Okay, it's getting windier. How do you look so good after staying the night in a cave? I just got a shower and I got all ready for the day. I haven't gotten ready. I was just starving so I'm eating some breakfast. <laughs> so we're all back from the cave. That was so, so crazy. We are finally home. We're feeling a lot better. All the kids got baths. I'm just happy to be home and out of that creepy, super scary cave. Here's the thing, bottom line is this. We're not sure if we should even continue pursuing and figuring out where this leads, so. Look how beautiful it is though. Let us know what you guys think we should do because I don't know if I wanna keep going on, but if you guys think we should, then maybe we ought to. So let us know in the comments below, what do you think, Charlie? Should we keep looking for more diamonds? Yeah. James, should we keep looking into it and study more? You're not too scared? I'm not, you are too scared. I'm, I'm not too scared. Ellie, what do you think? Should we keep looking or is it too scary with that phantom around? Mm, not too scary. Not too scary? Corbin, what do you think, buddy? I think we should look into we it should more. Look into it more? Wow, so everybody here is on board. I guess it's just up to you guys. Charlie, what do you think? Charlie, what did it say? It said, to, it said, don't take the diamond know what this is? It's a bagel with homemade peach jam. <laughs> Rebecca made homemade peach jam. And I think you did a pretty good job. That's for James. Yeah, your mom helped you out. Yep. You got a great mom. And I saved a couple of the perfect peaches so that I could eat them. Ah, yes. With cinnamon. Very good breakfast. It's a good thing you're getting a good meal because I have a feeling like today's gonna be a big day. We've been noticing some strange things are happening around here. Strange things. That's right. Strange things are happening to me. Ain't, Ain't no doubt about it. In all seriousness, you guys, ever since we've been back from that cave, we've been having a lot of weird things happening. I've been hearing a lot of strange sounds, especially at night, but I think that's mostly just because it's quieter at night. Yeah. And so, what? And socks are being thrown around out of nowhere. Don't get my apple. 
I drop. I'm sorry. Continue with whatever you're doing. <laughs> really? Like, have you noticed, Ryan, any weird sounds at night? Jared farting. <laughs> That's not what I'm talking about. Oh, really weird. Um, hey! Ah! We match! Camo pants, gray shirt. We're twinners. Great minds think alike. You're cute. You're cuter. <laughs> what about me? No. You're wearing no. your clothes. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> 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 but it's okay. I've I've been noticing weird sounds, but I've also been noticing like lights are flickering a lot. Yeah. When we turn on a light or when we walk into a room with lights, sometimes they'll yeah. flicker. And I, again, I don't notice it very much during the day because it's not as prominent. But yeah. but I've only started Ryan. Soccer. I've only started noticing that this happening since we've been back from the cave. Yeah, sometimes I'll make some food and then I'll go like turn around for a second and then I'll turn back around and there's like a bite out of it. And I'm really? Like, yeah, and I'm like, uh... It's probably the kids. Either the kids or I was like, I think I'll eat it now. <laughs> or it wasn't me. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Uh -huh. Oh, another one, the, another weird thing that I've noticed is sometimes I'll see shadows moving around yeah. when there's no shadow when there's like nothing moving that would yeah. cause it to move so today like there's because there's all these things that are happening we are going to try really hard to get them on camera and show you what's going on because it's so weird Mom! oh yeah that's another one everybody will be downstairs and i'll hear footsteps upstairs that's right yeah yeah have you noticed anything strange going on lately actually lately i have been having a really strange feeling Oh, I've actually been feeling kind of weird too lately. Cute. Like, <laughs> I'm pretty past that, I think. <laughs> it said, don't take the diamond. That's right, and actually, every now and then I'll hear whispers, and I and when everyone's asleep, and I don't know what it is. Yeah, it's ineligible, like I can't understand yeah. what they're saying. You know, like when you hear the, like the crowd murmur and stuff like that, I've heard that a little bit. It's like, you can't make sense of what they're saying. It's just, you can hear it. I think one of the things that's frustrating me the most is I feel like we were hunted now because yeah. we went to the, to the cave and got the diamond. But it frustrates me that Mr. E led us here. Like, it almost makes me I feel know. like I can't trust him anymore. Well, like, it's weird, but I feel like he made it so that we went there I guess it is kind of our fault in a way because we didn't look at the rest of the note like That's we were true. supposed to and, and we kind of skipped over that part. And he did say make sure to follow my instructions perfectly. And we didn't, so, so I, guess I guess it, it is, is kind of our, our fault. fault. But at the same time, if it was so dangerous and we were going to get haunted from something from that cave, why did he send us there? Right, what was the purpose? Yeah. Other than just to take the diamond? I know he said if we took it without touching it would be okay, but... Why would he, what's the purpose of getting the diamond? And we haven't right. heard anything from Mr. E either. Yeah. Maybe we should look closer to the diamond. Why would he have us go get the diamond, but we haven't gotten any more notes or any more clues since. Yeah, and we've kind of been like, I'm sure he's seen the videos now, right. by now. You think he would have done something? That he would have, he would have at least seen them and gone, oh, given us some type of response, but he hasn't messaged us at all. Yeah. It's like, he sent us there, and now he's not responding. I think right now the best thing we can do is try to take matters into our own hands. Yeah. Let's do some research online and see if there's anything yes. we can find out about this diamond. See if there's okay. any story purple or any... diamond or pink diamond. What pink color is it? Is that purple or diamond. pink? I can't really tell. I think it looks a little bit purple. I guess it kind of does look It could look be purple. pink. It just depends. Like, sometimes it picks up a lot of light, and sometimes it doesn't. So. Yeah. Pink let's, diamond, purple diamond. Let's look it up online and see what we can find. Okay, let's do it. Alright. Okay. Okay, this is the cave that we were looking at. And we were able to find it online. We're just doing a little bit of research, figuring out where it came from, what's the history of it. Big pink diamond. Legend. Wanted to see if we can find out anything about this. 30 million. No, that's not it. That's not it. This is the right color though. Yeah. I feel like this well, look up purple diamond actually. Okay. 
I think it's definitely more pink than purple. That's true. It's so big compared to all of the images in there. It's so huge. Oh my goodness, you guys. You have got to see what we just found on the internet about a pink diamond. We found some crazy things about diamonds and phantoms, and we just have to show you guys what we found. And I don't know what it means or where we're gonna go with this, but check it out. I found an article about a massive uncut pink diamond disappearing in transit. Look at that, it is the exact color. It's very possible this is the same diamond maybe after it's been cut. Yeah. And I was reading the article here and it says that, that it could be worth six million dollars is the estimated value at the time of its disappearance but the value could double once cut which means it could be worth 12 million dollars 12 million dollars for that oh my goodness but that's not all i was also reading an article about cursed diamonds and i read about the hortensia diamond which looks very similar to the one that we have and i don't know if it's the same or not this whole article talks about the Hortensia diamond and where it came from. This diamond specifically is known because it's cursed. We're noticing that we're being followed by whatever this phantom is, and I wonder if maybe that curse comes with the diamond, and maybe if it's, if it's the same Hortensia diamond. But this is the most interesting thing that I've found out, and it talks about wraiths, which are very similar to phantoms. And it says, according to lore, some wraiths are parasitic but not aggressive. They simply look for a host to bond with and feed off the energy of the person. They do not try to exert their will over their victim. They simply use the host to survive and not move on when their host dies. Whoa! So I'm wondering if maybe this wraith is, oh or a phantom is like connected with this diamond and now it's parasitic, you know, it's like attached itself to our family. Oh my goodness, I hope not, but that would make sense. <laughs> what if somebody touched the diamond, now the curse is on us? That's what I'm thinking. I think that's what, I think that is and what happened. Maybe the phantom is connected to the curse, and now, since we touched the diamond, the curse is on us, so the phantom falls to us now. Yeah. Oh my goodness, I hope not. That is so scary, especially because it doesn't, what does it leave once the host is dead? I don't want to die from a phantom, so. So, I'm gonna look up one other thing. We're gonna do a little bit more research and see what we can find out, because I do not want this to be something that is like a parasite that latches onto us and stays there until we're dead. That's scary. Guys, I think we just found the most important piece of the puzzle. In the research that we've been looking into, I found some articles about how different crystals can be used to do what's called scry. I, the word they use is scry, which basically means like... Seeing. It says the art or process of seeing is known as scrying, whereby images are claimed to be seen in crystals or other media such as water and are interpreted as meaningful information. The information gleaned then is used to make important decisions in one's life. Okay. And I was reading, and if you want to look right here, you can see some of these crystal balls are made from the same pink diamond material. And so I was wondering if this diamond that we have right now, what if this diamond has that same power? And that's why it's cursed and protected. And what if we looked through it and all of a sudden we could see new things or, or get some information out of it? Yeah. <gasps> well then let's look through it. I think that color looks exactly like the diamond we have. Oh, the computer just turned off. <laughs> what the heck? The TV just turned on. The TV turned on! Oh my goodness. Who turned on oh. the TV, guys? What is this? Oh, uh, where's the remote? Who turned it on? Find the remote! Somebody find the remote! It's too. What is this? It's so loud! Oh my goodness, let's turn this off. It's so creepy. Did you unplug it? <laughs> oh, finally. Whoa. That was really... Just like suddenly we, we were on the computer in there and then all of a sudden the TV turned on and it was like this crazy evil laugh video. Look. Yeah. The remote was here the whole time. Oh. And we look here. 
Re we gotta rewind the video and see if the remote was on the camera. Because I didn't see it there, that's why I- We looked everywhere. Where's the remote? Where's the remote? That was creepy. That was so weird. You know what it was like? It was like this TV turned on instead of that one being on and that one turned off. That is really like, weird. It was that like one turned off and this the one internet off. like swapped and it like glitched into a different video. Okay, that was just weird, especially because the remote showed up on the couch where we had already looked. Something's going on, you guys. Oh my goodness. Something very weird. I cannot believe that. that really <gasps> the lights are not on. Oh my goodness. Get to the light switch. <gasps> no one's touching the light switch. Oh. 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 What's going on and off? So this is what I've been telling you guys about. This is what's been happening. Remember I was telling you guys earlier that the lights are turning oh. on and off and we're hearing weird sounds? There's seriously there's nobody shots. touching that light switch right now and it's just doing it. Turn off. It turned off. It's <gasps> still back turning off. on. I didn't do that. Stay off. Whoa. I don't know what's going on. This is really creepy. Oh. Maybe we should go hide Guys, let's get out of here. Let's just go in the other room. Let's just go. <sighs> let's just get out of this house and go somewhere. It's still doing it. Wait, did it stop? Yeah. I think it's just off. No, we have to. <gasps> it's still doing it. No, it's doing it. It's still doing it. What are we going to do? Do we just leave? But, but no. also, yeah, last Maybe time. it's just like an electrical what if surge. I turn off the breaker? I'm gonna go turn off the breaker. This is creepy, guys. I, I wonder, it's like our house is haunted. But also, but we didn't find the clue when we looked in Grandpa's cave. All we found was the diamond and the note that said, do not touch the diamond. Where's the, is the breaker downstairs? I think so. Let's go check the breaker downstairs. Okay. Well, what if it's like the breaker was going out or something? Did the breaker's right there. Does that ever happen? Right, but how does that explain the TV right randomly there. turning on? And the computer randomly turning off. That's true. Oh, wow. All the breakers are on, so we should be fine. I don't know what's going on. Should I try turning them off? I don't know, like, would it break our house? <laughs> I don't know how to do it this stuff. It won't break stuff. our house, but it might. In the cartoons, you know, there's like some giant plug you can just unplug the house. <laughs> Like, maybe that's the thing, I, I don't even know. A breaker outside, too. Wait a minute, what about the diamond? We should look through the diamond and see what, maybe what we can find. We haven't been watching the diamond. Uh-oh. Uh Let's go get the diamond right now, you guys. Let's go! We gotta try and find it. Where is it? It's up there. It was right there before. Oh my goodness. Where is it? I don't, uh, I don't, I don't, I don't have it. So where do you think it went? This is literally where we had it. We had it right here. <gasps> the TV what? turned back on again? It was a, it's unplugged. Oh. Look at this. How did the TV get turned back on again? It's the same thing too. It's like all of laughs or something. It's unplugged. The TV is unplugged right now. <gasps> the microwave's on? Yeah, we turned on the microwave. We were all in the other room. An apple? <gasps> the lights are turning on. Oh my goodness. <gasps> what is going on? We can't even unplug the TV. We don't. <gasps> the lights are flickering. Oh my goodness. <gasps> I found the diamond. It's right you here. found it? Yeah. Look at the diamond. <gasps> Whoa. Everything stopped. The lights stopped flickering and the TV turned off. Are you seeing anything out of it? No, I'm not seeing anything. Maybe you should look all the way around. Oh my goodness, it all stopped. Oh my goodness, the TV is off, the lights stopped flickering. Look, they're just on now, they're just turned on. That is so weird. Becca, <gasps> I see something on the wall over here. Really? Yeah, check it out, you gotta look, look at it. <gasps> it's gone. Really? There's nothing on the wall. Wait. It's there when I look through the diamond. Really? But when I don't look through the diamond, it's gone. What does it say? 
You gotta see this. Oh. Here, take wow. a look. Here, let's put the camera up to the diamond. Okay. Well, I'm so glad all of our hunting stopped. Look. <gasps> Whoa! It says undo, and it has a skull and crossbones. Wait, wait, pull it away from the camera, or pull the diamond away. Let's see if it goes, if it disappears. Okay. <gasps> There's nothing there. Oh my goodness. I'm looking at the same wall. That is so crazy. But if you look through there, now you can see it. <gasps> and we're looking at the same wall here. You can see the bench and the keys. I, and I saw something dead here. Okay, it says undo. Oh wow. Undo. Undo, you look down, you'll see some stuff. undo my curse. <gasps> undo the my curse. <gasps> the undo Phantom's curse. curse. That's the only person that could have sent us oh. that message. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> What if the diamond is cursed? We, we figured that out, right? The diamond must be cursed. But why would the phantom say, undo my curse? Well, we're cursed by the phantom. He's, he's, he's haunting us. We're cursed by the phantom, but what if the curse is also cursing him? Do you hear that? Return here tonight. <gasps> Did you hear that? <laughs> return here tonight. Let's just it's do this. Like, let's stay here, but let's return to this spot tonight. Okay. Whoa. All right, guys. It's really late. It's it's not super late, but it's getting dark outside. It's getting later. And we've decided, I think this is the time that we need to come back. Because the Phantom told us to come back at dark, when it's late. And so it's almost sunset outside. You can kind of tell it's getting dark, it, um, darker outside. It looks bright on the camera, but it's actually pretty dark. Exactly. Yeah. So um, I think we should return back to the wall. Okay. Um, and see what kind of a message we can see. Right now I'm looking at the wall. I'm gonna come. You're gonna come too? Yeah. Okay. Too. Looking at the wall right now, I'm not seeing anything. But I think we should try looking through the diamond and see what we can see. Yes, the let's diamond! Just... Okay. Diamond! Diamond! Okay, very, very careful. Whoa. Very careful. Do you see anything, Ellie? What do you see? Do you see anything? Let's go look at this wall over here. Yeah. This is the wall where the phantom sent us that message earlier today. See you see something? <gasps> what is it? Let's put it on the camera. Let's make sure. Let the camera... Corbin take a look. Oh, I do see something. Can I see? Do you? It says undo the curse. <gasps> oh. You're right. It does. It has the crossbone skulls. Whoa. Okay, so it's kind of dark in here, so it's having a hard time focusing. And, and it makes it makes sense. It does make sense. Okay, let me see the that. Yeah, I'm gonna try looking through the diamond here. Okay, I'm looking through. Yes, the message is there still, and it says undo my curse. But there's more. Look at that. What does that say? Oh, that's hard to read on here. Hmm. Yeah, it's a little bit hard to read through the diamond. Wait. Wait. What? Oh my goodness, it's starting to appear. Look at that. It's like the light from the diamond is like shining on the wall now and you can actually read it without even looking through the diamond. Look at that. Oh my gosh, it totally is. It's kind of like in the cave. Do you remember when yeah. we found the cave? How there was like, like the light, light coming out of the diamond light. when we were on the yeah. cave? The diamond's glowing. It's diamond. And look, I can point it right at the wall. The diamond Whoa. is glowing. <gasps> we should read these words. Okay, undo, undo my, curse. my curse. Your spiritual trial begins, begins now. Whoa. And there are arrows. Whoa. Arrows. The leading up. Oh, there's, there's one. I think that the reason why the phantom told us to come back after dark is so that we could see the light emanating through the diamond. Yeah. Because I think when it's really bright outside, like we were in a really right. pitch black cave when we saw the diamond glowing in the first place. That's right. Whoa! Whoa! Oh, I got it! <gasps> yeah, I think that the diamond only glows in a dark space. It but does. if it's too bright, you can't see it glowing. That's why he said come back at night. That's what, right. Where do the arrows lead to? We should try following it and see where it leads. It leads what do you guys back. think? Whoa, that's so cool that the diamond is glowing like that. Whoa. And look at that mess. You can see 
the Ellie. glowing, it's projecting light through the diamond up onto the wall. Wow. Okay, oh, there's so. another one that's hard to see. <gasps> oh yeah, there there's is one. one. It's up on the roof. Okay, I'm gonna keep moving in the direction that the arrow is pointing. Another one! Oh, there is another one. Oh yeah. That is wow. so cool that it's projecting light from the diamond. Yeah. Because it was not glowing earlier today. Oh, okay, yeah. there's one right there. That's the last one I can see. Okay, okay. Okay. Oh. Oh. There's <gasps> arrows pointing to the family. Oh, and look. There's one around each of these and underneath the beach house. I don't know if that was there before. But it's pointing at our family. It looks like something was underlined underneath the beach house family. Interesting. Okay, the oh, weirdest whoa. part is, look. Whoa, I saw words. <gasps> oh. I two, two was, was so long ago, but never <gasps> broke it as you know. I too was cursed so, so long, long ago, ago, but never broke it as you know. Okay, the weird thing is, look at this light switch. That's cool. It looks completely normal without, right? Is that just me? Are we supposed no, to? No, I see like there's an outline around the lights. Let's flip it, Corbin. <gasps> what was that? Somebody here? Yes. It was the phantom. <gasps> Is it the phantom here? Yeah. No, it's there. Is there anybody there? No. no Seriously? There. No. no. That's super weird. That is really weird. Right before what? we were about to switch it. Yeah, we were standing right here. We were looking at the wall and there was messages on the wall. That's right. Oh, I thought I saw something right here. I, okay, let's flip the switch. Should we? Flip the switch and see what happens. It's just the kitchen light. Okay. And we flip the switch a million times. And yeah. We're not like. Oh, hey, there's a light flickering over there. <gasps> what? What the heck? Whoa, that's so creepy. Who's? There's no one touching the switch. No. That's the switch. No. This is the, there's two switches in this room. This and this. Oh, it's There's stopped. another one over there. It stopped. Oh. Another light? Oh my goodness. Another? Another what? light is flickering. What? What is on your shirt? But that one stopped over there. Oh. And then that one, wait. There's a, over there, over there. Oh. It's like it's leading us somewhere. Oh my goodness. Oh. What? what the heck? And there's no one messing with the light switches. The light switches are all not changing. Oh. And yet the light is freaking oh. out. Huh. That one just turned on. It wasn't on before. <gasps> this is the light switch for that. Oh my god. Jessica, did you see the lights? Oh. Ah. It's leading us here. here. Oh, this oh, is like my god. It's like in Stranger Things. <laughs> Oh yeah, oh my gosh. Do you remember gosh. when like in Stranger Things there was something that was from the upside down or whatever and like the lights were leading them from room to yes. room? Yes! <gasps> um, this is so creepy. This room is there. going crazy. Oh, 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 there's the oh, light switch right there. Look, 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 look. What? In order that you <gasps> break my curse, follow all my text and verse. What? I want to... Oh, the car! The car's moving! Ah! 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 Really? Uh, okay, okay. Well, it's going. Where's it going? Uh, it's leading to the bathroom. Whoa! Car, stop! How is it moving? I wonder if, it, yeah, maybe it's trying to lead us somewhere. Watch out, everybody, move. Get out of the way. Whoa, 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 whoa. It is going whoa. downstairs. Oh, it's gonna be broken for sure. But wait, it was broken before. Well, the remote was broken. 
It's okay, still let's working. just look it's for still our... working. It's, the, it's the bell just went off. And it's not it's exactly at the time we just got But this bell's broken. It's been broken for a long time. It really has. How is it going off right now? Oh, I don't know. Oh my goodness. Wait. The car led us down here, and then and the, the bell went off. What? Oh! Fragile as a poor, poor saint. Porcelain. Whoa. Porcelain. Fragile as a porcelain vase. Like, like a, clock, a clock, it has it, a face. Has uh, okay, a porcelain vase with a face. We have to look for something, maybe? The Okay, that's just weird. Maybe there's a porcelain vase. Wait, I can't see the message anymore. Oh, it's so crazy that the that the that that this diamond is projecting that much light onto the wall. It's so we would not have been able to see this if it was Look at this. light this is outside. Without the diamond, there's nothing. You can there. see nothing. Nothing. And then it just appears. It's literally there's nothing there without it. That is so bizarre to me. Uh, okay, everything kind of calmed down for a minute. It was like uh, almost haunted here. Yeah. For a second. Do you guys see anything okay, a interesting? Balloon. A balloon? Huh. That wasn't there before. It's moving. It's moving. Like it's it's moving. The it's balloon moving. is moving. Well, okay, follow it, follow it. Um, oh, it's moving all by itself. Upstairs. Michael, go, go. Okay, go. I'm going. Where is it going, guys? Stairs. But it's not like yeah. hitting the ceiling. You'd think if it was a balloon, it would hit the ceiling. It is clean. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Weird, where is it going? It's going up now. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Follow it, follow it. It's leading us somewhere. Yeah. It's like it's got a mind of its own. Whoa, it's going all by itself. What? Yeah. What? It's stopping. The balloon went into my bedroom. Yeah. I wonder why. That is so weird. Ew. I wonder why the balloon went in our room. There's the balloon. It's just the balloon's just hovering. Oh! Oh! Look! What? 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 Oh! There's it went a message. There and then it popped. It exploded, and now there's a message on the oh. mirror. Oh! It says, "I am trapped, just like this mirror." Forever near, but can't appear. can't appear. Can't appear. So I, I am trapped just like this mirror. Forever near, but can't appear. Wait, is this the Phantom talking about himself? I think so, because he said he too was cursed so long ago. Do you remember? Yeah. But never broke it, as you know. That's and then, really and then he said, if you want to break this curse, follow all my text and verse. Follow all my text and verse. I think. So he's trying to tell us something. I think the the phantom is trying to tell us something, right? Whoa. And I think that he's leading us, and he has messages to help us understand what's going on. So, so I am the phantom trapped. is trapped. Just like this mirror, forever near but can't appear. That means we need to just wait and see what happens next, because obviously he's leading us somewhere. He sent us that little remote-controlled car and all of the lights leading us in the right direction. And the balloon. And the yeah, balloon. he's been directing us so this whole time. So let's just wait and see what happens here. Okay, let's look around. Maybe there's another message close by that we haven't seen yet. No. Hmm. There's even more behind the other one. Hmm. We need to be looking around for all of the different, like all of the different areas to see. Oh, I think it went through. It threw here. The door was shut. Gosh, it went downstairs. It went downstairs. It's in the family. It went into the family room? Yes. Oh, man. The phantom is down there. Guys, we're going to stay together. Stay together. Charlie, come. Stay with us. Okay, stay here, boys. I just saw it go down into the family room. We need to be careful. Watch closely. Do you guys see anything? No, no, no. There's no phantom in Should here. Should we go where he was at? Yeah, well, he came straight. He came in right through these doors. That's what you said. Yeah. yeah, so he came in right past these doors. I wonder if maybe there's something else here in the living room that we need to look for. What? Um, whoa, 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 whoa. What? <gasps> oh! You'll find 
A whole message. What in a trunk? When Whoa! What does it say? In a trunk, you'll find a key. When, when it's, it's broke, broke then, then we'll be free. free. We'll or be free. We'll. I wonder if he's talking about us too, because we have the same curse now as the Phantom. Oh. And Are the Phantom will be free phantoms? Phantoms if, if we, we never don't... break the curse. Ooh, I don't like that. So we have to break the curse to set ourselves free and the Phantom free. I wonder if that's why we were sent to find the diamond was so that we could help. In a trunk you'll find a key. When it's broke, then, then it will we'll be... be... A trunk. Oh! Oh! In a trunk oh. you'll find a key. I wonder if this is the trunk that it's talking about. Let's take a look. Sure we'll Let's take a look at this trunk. Watch out, guys. Watch out, Ellie. I don't see anything. No. Is there a key in here? No, there's no key. Some rings and some coins. Hmm. The coins are mine. Whoa! Whoa! The faucet's on. The sink. Uh, who turned that on? Who did that? Not me. Someone turned the water on. Wait, is there something over here? Do you hear more water? I hear another faucet too. It's on full blast. Turn it off, Charlie. Okay. Go. Can you get it? There we go. That was really weird. I can still hear water moving. The washer? Downstairs. Maybe downstairs. I think Ellie's right. Downstairs? Yeah, Ellie said check downstairs. No Do you hear water? I hear water down here. Are you kidding? It's louder. Yeah. Whoa. It's in the bathroom. Uh, oh. Okay, so all of these faucets are randomly just turning on? Yes, the, the water faucets are just turning on. Oh, all. it's going to overflow. It's going to overflow. Turn it off. Turn it off. Okay. Okay, wait. Is there oh. anything in here? Oh, are you looking? Another sink. The other sink is on! Oh, oh my goodness, it's splashing everywhere! Ah. Turn it off! That was weird. I don't hear any more water though. And I don't see anything. Oh, it's in the bathroom! The bathroom just turned back on! Oh, hey, this is so creepy! Oh, oh so Becca! Creepy. There's something! <gasps> right here, guys! Guys, right here. guys it's over Wait, here! So they were trying. The Phantom. The Phantom turned on that sink, and then he turned on that sink, and then he turned on that sink again to make trying us. Trying to get us to walk this. past this door says, so we'd see the message. Destroy this elephant. Destroy this elephant in, in the room. room. Then, then you'll, you'll be, be free, free from all my doom. Oh. So wow. does that mean open this door? There's this big closet in here. Is there anything in it? <gasps> no, it's the words. Whoa! Oh, what's it? Handprint. Look. This is just. Look at that. Cover up the diamond. I want to see if we can see anything without the glow of the diamond. Won't shine so bright. I want to see something. Is it? Yeah. Look. You can see glowing. It's. It's almost like there's a light behind the wall. No, really. Do you see that? Yeah, I gotta break it. Wait. There's like. There's light emanating from behind the wall. Oh, it is. Wow. Do you see that? Yeah. Don't yeah. break it. Whatever you do, don't break it. <gasps> oh my goodness. Whoa, there's a message written on it. It just appeared. That was not there before. It says help. There's a we're, message. We're literally underneath our stair closet in my <laughs> mom's house. And like, I cannot believe that that just showed up. That's so creepy, that really, okay, that means for sure, 100%, the Phantom needs our help. Yes. And he has been trying to tell us something trying this to whole communicate time. communicate with us, that's to right. communicate with us. And I think, I wonder if Mr. E knew the Phantom maybe before, and oh, tried to send us sent on this us, mission to help him. He sent us to the cave where we found the diamond right. and got the curse. So it was necessary for us to get cursed so that we could help the phantom. Oh. <gasps> Another message. It says me now. That wasn't there before. It keeps changing. It says help, help And now me. it says me. Help me. I wonder if we help need me. to see if there's anything behind the wall maybe. Because it, there's like light glowing behind oh, the wall. It's literally glowing. 
Wow. And there's a handprint. Help me with a handprint. So being able to use the diamond, we can see more. Wow. There's so many hidden messages on there. Yeah. Help me and the handprint. Well, we should just do it then. Now the diamond is projecting prison bars through its light, almost like maybe... Should I push it? I think we should. Oh my goodness, this wall is seriously glowing behind it. There's Look something, at that. Something back there. And Corbin, did it do anything when you put your handprint on it? No. On the handprint? I think we just need to bust through it and see what's behind it already. Okay. Alright. Wait. <gasps> okay, yeah, yeah, use the diamond light to help us see. I opened it. <gasps> There's something. Wait, 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 okay, move the wall. Let's, let's yeah, pull it's that like out. A, it's like not even a real wall, but there's was, something back whoa. there. That's so creepy! Oh, the eye! Oh, its the eyes eye. are glowing. Oh, wow. That's the elephant in the room! The elephant in the room! Here. Wait, we have to read the other message back. Yeah. It said break the trunk. Do you remember there was one that said break the trunk, you'll find a key? <gasps> That's right. It said break the trunk, you'll find a key. And you have to break break the, the vase to break the curse. Remember? So we have to break that. Follow it all my text like and verse. Yeah. It looks antique. It does, but it's it. an old artifact, and that's why the, the curse of the phantom is a very old oh, curse. Oh, that would make sense. Oh. Wait, no, no, no. Let's grab it and let's bring it out of here. It's never good to break things inside the house. Maybe we can find a cardboard box outside and break it. Let's take it outside. It's so heavy. Can you even carry it, Corbin? No. Maybe I'll need to carry it. Okay. <gasps> Careful. We don't want to break it in here. Don't glass in Do the you need help, buddy? Wait, pull the Did you hear that? Wrench. Did you hear that? Oh. Okay, I'm gonna pull the diamond away and see. <gasps> oh. Whoa. Oh, All right. Oh, that is so heavy. I don't even know if okay, I'm gonna be able to carry let's, it. Let's get out of here. Let's go into the garage. Let's see if James can carry it upstairs. Can you even lift it? Okay, wow. be very careful with it. So heavy. Okay, I'm gonna follow James. Let's go, let's go. Be careful. Okay, it's almost nighttime We're out here on the patio, and we've got this strange, very creepy elephant here that we found in the Cause basement. The eyes. Because the eyes do glow, so we're gonna try and see if we can break it, it like, like, like the messages eyes. say. And maybe if we break it, then we'll break the curse and set the phantom free. Wouldn't that be weird if we broke that elephant, the elephant in the room and it, it broke the curse? That's right, well that's what that it said. That would be so weird. That's all we can do is try it. Okay. We should probably set down the diamond, set that down, and you guys stay close. We're gonna break this very, very creepy elephant here. I grabbed some cardboard so it'll break on the cardboard, but that way it's not gonna be right. Mm, so loud. So that way it won't shatter all over Everywhere. the back of the patio here. Oh, its oh, eyes. Its eyes are so, so creepy. Okay. All right. Um, I'm just gonna drop it. Okay. I'm gonna put this, put my feet behind this though. Okay. So ready? Oh, I feel really bad. This is like an antique. Look at it. Right, but it's also the cursed. And we have to break it to break the curse. Okay, ready? I'm ready. Set. Go. Whoa. Oh. Oh my goodness. Watch out. Oh, did you hear that? I heard a, the sound. It sounded like the phantom sound. <gasps> Don't breathe. Don't breathe. Get away. Walk away. Everybody walk away. Whatever was in that, I just got the most disgusting whiff of like old, musty ancient, air. musty. Like I think I breathed in some of it. Yeah. It was really gross. That's crazy. I hope I'm not like poisoned. Or There's something. a message. Look. <gasps> it's moving. It's moving. <gasps> what does it say? Whoa, 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 whoa! Don't move, guys. Don't move. Hold still. Hold still. Let me see if I can read it. It's moving. All on its own. It's I know. It's just air. kind of floating. Okay, hold still everyone. Okay, I can read it. It says, the curse is broken. You are free. I no longer bother thee. The diamond's yours now. Use it well. 
many secrets it will tell. Oh. Look. There's nothing. It's just, it's just floating there. Can you hand over the top? Maybe it's hanging in there. No, see? Oh. It's not even, it's not oh. even responding at all. Oh. That is crazy. It's literally floating there. It's a, it's like a haunted note right now. I still can't even believe this. Oh! <gasps> it's gone! It disappeared! It, lit, it literally lit on fire and and disappeared! It's gone! <gasps> oh! Oh my goodness! <gasps> get away, get away! It's burning! The whole elephant is on fire! The elephant's burning now too! The note burnt and now the, the elephant is on fire. Oh, I'm so glad all the kids are away. Whoa. Whoa! Wow! I think the curse is broken, you guys. We did it. We broke the curse. We and the note, and the note said the diamond's yours now. Use it well, so we get to keep the diamond in all of its power. Wow! We need to put it where all of our treasures are. Yeah. Some of the pennies are on fire. That's so oh strange. Goodness. Look at this, there's some pennies on the fire, just right in the middle. Yeah. It's turning green and blue. Green and blue flames. Oh my goodness. Look at the flames, they're turning green and blue. Oh, it's no. Huh? <gasps> Thank you. <gasps> he disappeared. Oh. The oh. phantom's gone. He said, and we the curse is broken. We broke. We did we it. Broke the curse we, we broke the curse. Oh my goodness! Look, at, it's almost completely burnt out. The fire's fading. I think that means the curse is out. Oh, it's, it's done. It's, it's done. all gone. Oh, wow. We, we, it was like the fire that came out of it was the phantom. The, the was the remainder of the curse, I think. And then it just burnt out, and he said thank you, and now the phantom is gone. We did it. Well guys, we did it. We broke the curse of the phantom diamond. And it and stopped what? glowing. We, We're not cursed anymore. The phantom's gone. We get a gone. whole giant diamond. And we get to keep the diamond, which has a really cool power, because I think that could come it in really handy. It can show up things that we can't see at all. That's so do right. you, it's like a special eye that can see things that our eyes can't see. That's right. Wow. Cool, all right. Well, I, I can't believe it. we got rid of the phantom. I'm so and happy! freed him, and he was cursed too, and so I'm so glad that we were able to set him free. Yes. Mystery! That mystery wanted us to get the diamond and break it so we can use it for the rest of his treasure hunt. I think you're right. And maybe he knew about the phantom, and maybe he wanted us to get cursed so that we could help the phantom get because uncursed. Because he knew that we had the skills and abilities to break the curse that nobody Whoa. else could. That so he so knew that crazy. he could trust us with this. Well, you know, that means that the Phantom wasn't ever really evil. No. He just was trying to get our attention and That's give right. us a message. And help to break this curse. Wow. Wow. Okay, thank you guys so much for watching and helping us on this crazy, awesome adventure. We couldn't have done it without all of you guys' love and support. And we're so excited that it's over and I think there's gonna be wait, more to come. Wait. Let us know in the comments below wait. if you wanna see more videos just like this. We love you guys and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Pause, Pause the, the game. game.